Hello everyone. So now I'm going to discuss what is about real number line. It is suitable for solving the quadratic equation, cubic equation, rational equations. 26 would be the step. And then I'm going to further the discussion in the following example. Here are the example 17. Find the value of x for x squared plus 6x plus 5 greater than 0 by using the real number line. Step number one, I'm going to factorize the situation. So we will have x plus 5, x plus 1 greater than 0. So this will be the simplest form. Next, we are going to determine or make sure that what kind of value they wish to have, which is a positive value. So next step would be assume positive. So x plus 5 greater than 0 x plus 1 greater than 0 this is the case that we need to always assume it is a positive so x greater than negative 5 and x greater than negative 1 so next we are going to illustrate the situation in the real number line by putting the value in order so we have to follow the situation where we have x which is greater and negative 5 empty circle greater than negative 5 next would be x which is greater than negative 1 so we have negative 1 empty circle next we have to putting the value negative okay here also negative here also negative why it is a negative? Because we already assume it is a positive real number line. So here we will have positive, negative and positive. As we mentioned earlier, we need a positive value. So here will be our answer. So finally, we have to illustrate the answer. Negative infinity until negative 5, where negative 5 is not included, union negative 1 until infinity where negative 1 is not included in a inequalities or interval form if it is uh, in set notation our answer will be x less than negative 5 or x greater than negative 1 so here we are and thanks for watching